So it's been a long time since I made a story video, right? Where I just like sit down and talk and make a story. And uh, this is not going to be like a full story video. It's going to be kind of uh, in between where I talk about a story. And then I just kind of want to talk about stuff that's like on my mind. Also, uh, I did want to say that I, uh, I made a Pornhub channel. Um, if, uh, if YouTube doesn't uh, end up working out or uh, if, you know, I want to upload my videos to another platform, I made that. So, um... But, you know, the funny thing is, is they, uh, I, I uploaded the video on there yesterday, m one of my newest videos, and, uh, they sent me an, uh, email, you know, saying, you know, your, your video's up, thank you. And, uh, they sent me another email, probably, like, 20 minutes later, saying, um, your video has been removed. And, uh, I was, I was like, oh, okay, you know, <laughs> I guess I'll just try Vimeo. Besides all that, uh, yeah, today's gonna be a story, and, uh, hopefully you guys enjoy it. Leave a like if you do. And, uh, this is gonna be about the time that I went to Miami or, uh, Florida. This was, like, five years ago, so I was still pretty young, right? I just went with my brother to, uh, go visit family out there. They don't live out there anymore. I would really like to go see them, uh, sometime soon. But, uh, I don't even really, like, remember where they live. <laughs> so, yeah, it was just me and my brother, and, uh, we were going on a plane. It was, like, probably, I think, a seven-hour plane ride or something. Uh, which is really nuts. I think I, I slept for, like, two hours of it. But, uh, we just watched a movie for the rest of the time. And, um, we arrived, and, like, the first night there was really nice, like, uh, we had Hooters and everything, and, uh, and, uh, the girls at Hooters were, like, really pretty. I don't think I've ever, like, been to Hooters before. I don't even, like, remember, uh, what I got. I've always seen, like, Hooters in, uh, like, movies and stuff. I remember this one Adam Sandler movie. It was one where he, like, got that kid, he adopted him. I mean, like, he was staying with him until he, uh, you know, was able to find a home. So he, like, adopted him for that time, and, uh, you know, when the kid was able to, uh, get a home finally he uh you know he didn't want him to leave so i'll look up the movie later and uh, put it in the video yeah so we arrive and we go to hooters the first night and uh that was really fun really like that and uh i mean everyone thinks that like oh miami's bad and like we were in like the good part of miami like, i don't know how to explain it but the like the apartments that we were in like were really really good like they weren't bad apartments they weren't like terrible and we were in like a really good spot of miami i remember waking up one morning and uh me and my aunt we uh, went to Dunkin' Donuts, like, at that time, I was, like, really in love with Dunkin' Donuts, like, I, I went there pretty much, like, every single morning. I used to get, a uh, iced coffee, a large iced coffee, I think, with, uh, hazelnut syrup. Not hazelnut creamer, hazelnut syrup. It, it, I don't know, it turns, like, the coffee, like, this nice brown, like, caramel color, almost. It looks really, really awesome, and, uh, it tastes really good, too. But I mean, yeah, I haven't had that iced coffee in probably like three years at least. But uh, we went to Dunkin' Donuts and uh, we got donuts and uh, obviously my iced coffee. And I think later that day we ended up going to the beach. I don't have any photos of like when I was here. Like I really wish I did. They were on my other phone if anything. But the beach when you go there, like the water is so blue and it's so warm and everything. It's not like how it is here in like LA and everything. Dude, the LA weather here and like... Oh, not to mention, Miami, it rains, and it's, like, sunny. The weather is kind of bipolar, dude. It's raining one minute, and then it's sunny the next minute, dude. It's really weird, but, like, it's always hot there. Like, it, it's kind of, like, shitty weather. I don't know if I would want to live there, but it was it was awesome visiting there for a week. Um, We get there, we get to the beach, and, like, the water is so blue, and it's really warm. The water there is not like the water here. The water here is all dark blue and it's gross looking. And dude, the water here is freezing, by the way. This traveling story got me reminded of another time where I went on a plane. I brought this fake gun in my suitcase and the TSA people freaked out, dude. And it was not a fun time. I'll tell that story probably another time. But I'm at the beach and I'm in the water and I look over and I see this, uh, this girl. And she's not wearing, like, her, her swimsuit. She's not wearing, you know, anything. And, uh, that was the first time and the only time that I saw a pair of boobies. <laughs> oh, God, dude. Yeah, that was the only time that I saw a pair of boobies. And I've never seen a pair after that. And, uh, yeah. That was really fun. I mean, I didn't really, like, see a whole lot. Uh, my eyes are kind of bad. But, like, that was, like, the highlight of, of my day right there, okay? And, uh, yeah, like, that was pretty much it. I mean, there was, like, one more day left, and, uh, we ended up going to, I think, an aquarium? Or, no, we went, oh, yeah, we went on this boat, and it had, like, a motor in the back of the boat. Uh, you guys probably know what I'm talking about. We went in, like, this swamp, and we were able to see, like, these, uh, 
these alligators and everything, like real alligators, and it was it was really awesome. It was like I guess like a safari, um, but I like after seeing like the show Dexter, you know that's in Miami. Well, I mean, it's supposed to be in Miami. Um, yeah, I mean you see like alligators on that show sometimes and everything, but there yeah there were alligators in Miami, and uh, I saw like alligators, and I went like in the I we went we went on the boat ride on the swamp and everything. It was a really awesome experience. I, I don't know if I would do it again, though. Uh, I mean, thinking about it now, it's kind of terrifying. Like, pff, Jesus, dude. But, um, and uh, that brings me to my next point. And the next thing that I want to talk about, like, I want to travel uh, a lot more in the future. Like, a lot more in my life. And uh, and the places that I have in mind, kind of, uh, that I, like, had in mind for a few years now are um, Europe. I never really had it in mind, but I do want to uh, revisit Miami now, even though my family doesn't live there anymore. I want to go to Amsterdam, kind of. Um, I don't know. That's kind of a new one. Dude, I'm forgetting so much. Paris would be awesome to visit, I I guess. Oh my god, I almost forgot. I drove to Denver one time with my family. It was like probably six years ago um, and we, with my other aunt and uh, their, their kids and everything. And we drove for like two days, stopped like on a hotel one night and uh, slept there and uh, got on the road in the morning at like 9 a.m. and drove the rest like seven hours to get there the third day or something. And I've only been in snow, real snow, uh, one time. That's it, only one time. But uh, speaking of Denver, there was like this hill right across the street from uh, my aunt's and uncle's house, and uh, they had this park, and there was this big hill going down this park, like this concrete hill that you would just walk down. But uh, like obviously, like it would snow, and uh, you know the path would be like there would be a lot of snow. And I went down one time, like on this sled. Uh, while it was, uh, snowing, like, while it, like, while the path was, uh, in snow and everything, and, uh, it was, like, probably the most fun I've ever had, and, uh, I would really like to do that again, but, uh, I mean, yeah, like, traveling, dude, you get to meet, like, so many people, like, so many new people, and, uh, you know, just the things that you see, really, and the photos that you take, and the videos that you, you have, and it's just really awesome to look back on that kind of stuff, and, uh, or even talk about this stuff, like I'm talking about right now. But, um, yeah, like, traveling is something that I do want to do in the future, and, uh, possibly make, like, a few YouTube videos, uh, doing it. I don't really know. Maybe that's something that I'll be able to do in the future. Uh, my friend wants me to go to Japan with him. That sounds like something that I would be really, really interested in. And I told him yes. And, uh, like, I, I guess, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna go to Japan. And if I do, like, I'll, I'll vlog it or whatever. I don't really know. I'm not too big on vlogging. I've never done it before. But, um... I don't know when we're going to do that, or, you know, if it's a year from now, if it's two years from now, ten years from now, I don't know, but, um, yeah, I'll, I'll, like, I'll vlog that, or at least talk about it, take some pictures and show you guys when that happens, but, um, yeah, I think just traveling has always been, like, a really, really awesome thing to do, uh, provided that you have the money, but, I mean, like, you're able to get up and, like, travel anywhere you want, you're able to travel wherever you want and just kind of get away for a few days or even a week. And, uh, I, I think just traveling is really, really awesome and a really, really good opportunity to learn new stuff. But, um, yeah, I'm kind of rambling now. Um, this video is going to be probably longer, uh, than I expected. And, uh, you know, if you guys want to let me know your guys' experience traveling, yeah, dude, I mean, let me know. Go for it. But, uh, yeah, that has been the video for today. Hopefully you guys have been enjoying my videos lately, too. Uh, I've been trying to upload, like, one video a day. I mean, I'm not really trying to. That's honestly just how it's been kind of working out. But, um, yeah, hope you guys have a great rest of your day and, uh, later.